So you can't, you can't deal with a guy that got a job? Do you have a job, Jay? Yes. Okay, why well, can't I deal with you? The reason why I cannot deal with <laughs> <laughs> she no, said it as a, like it was like an option. Like, no, it's not an option, and that's what I was going to say. With respect to your girlfriend, that's not that's not what she's I. She's not going to take it person. Yeah, she no, I can't working. take anybody that got a job either. That's why I said I, would. I don't not, want nobody with a job because Cause if, we want to go to Jamaica yeah. to see your girl's family. And you can't because you got to not. Your, when it comes, but you can't tell them like, oh, I gotta go to Jamaica tomorrow. True. Like you got to. No, but when it so comes you could just to leave me. your job. I mean. Anytime, like right, like you told us, we had to push the time back because you didn't get off work till a certain time. Like that yeah. already is like a hassle. Okay. No, but That's a red flag. for me, no, not it's flag. not a red flag. But for me personally, because I know when a lot of people say, "Oh, I can't date a man with a job," a lot of people on the internet take it to offense. But me, mm -hmm. Destiny, cannot mm -hmm. date a man with a job one because I'm very spontaneous, and I need wait, 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 Jay, before you get to leaning back and breaking the chair. What I'm saying is, and I also need a man to understand where I'm at in the moment that I'm at. Like, I probably will have a week where I work so much, and then I have a week where I don't work at all. You get what I'm saying? So as an entrepreneur, it's like it's very up and down, and mm -hmm. I just want somebody to understand the mental state that I'm in. Sometimes I get really, really depressed because I always have to show up for people. Mm -hmm. So then I'll be like, I, I want a man to be there to comfort me during that moment. I just feel like a so man. So you want a maid too? I don't want a maid. I want a man. I want you to notice how she's still looking for a man. I want y'all to notice how she's still single. Ladies, don't let this woman trick y'all out of good men. Ain't nothing wrong with a nine to five. Ain't nothing wrong with an eight to five. Ain't, ain't nothing wrong with a nine to three. All my plumbers, McDonald workers, Burger King workers, wherever you work at, ain't nothing wrong with that. Trust me. Women like this will have you single and miserable. She is trying to set up something that she knows is impossible to complete. See, women like this would never be satisfied, ever. See, you can be with her and give her everything she want. You can be up all up on her, giving her all the attention she want. And then she'd be like, oh, can you give me a break? Why are you smothering me? Or she'd be like, oh, can I have some money? Well, baby, how can I give you money if you don't want me to work? Then you say you don't want me to have a job. Oh well, I, I'm gonna need you to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna need you to give me some money then. See what I'm saying? She would never be. <laughs> this woman right here is, is, a, is a ticking time bomb for any man because she ain't never gonna be perfect. She always gonna, she always gonna move, move the ball. One minute she, she, you trying to make her happy over here, then when you make her happy right here, she want, she don't want, she don't want to be happy, so she want to go over here to, to be unhappy. This the type of woman that you can never please, fellas. When you ever meet a woman like this and tell you she don't want you to work, run your ass away.